All right, so here's a quick tip for uh, the hemiptera key that starts on page 401 in your textbook. We're on page 407 in the hemiptera key, and uh, we're taking a look at step 8. And this is asking whether the claws of at least prothoracic legs are subapical in position, or the other choice is that claws are in the normal apical position. Now in digesting this couplet here, first of all, prothoracic legs, those are your front legs. And then we want to find out where the claws are. Now apex means the tip, and so if something is subapical, it means it's not quite at the tip. Otherwise, the other choice is that the claws are in the normal apical position, meaning that the claws are coming out of the very tip of the foot. So one uh, final way you can go back and check your work is that if you did have your insect uh, and it had claws that were subapical, uh, that would have led you to step nine. And notice that both of the families, Geridae and Valiidae, are uh, followed by an asterisk, which in our textbook means that they are aquatic. You would have collected these on the surface of a pond or a stream. Uh, otherwise, if you go back to step eight and you find that the claws are in normal apical position, so the claws are just right there at the tip, the very tippy end of the foot, uh, then this would have led you to step 10, and step 10 picks up uh, with more terrestrial insects that you would have caught on land. That wraps it up for this little tip, but uh, of course, ask me anytime if you have any difficulties in the keys, and I'll be sure and help. Thanks so much.